Got the camera here, just a quick overview of a camera I bought on eBay. I've bought a few, you probably see on my channel, this little channel I've created really only for reference for myself. But I've bought a few film cameras, uh, been trying them out to sort of see which one's the best, sort of bring back some memories of when I used to, when I was at art college and using, well actually a Pentax back in the day. So I've, I've got a Ashai Pentax uh, Spotmatic here, which I've been using. Um, on it is an M42 mount and on this one I've got the uh, Helios uh, 44 lens which is a 58mm f2 which is famous for its bokeh um, it's a really good lens um, screws in and on the front just you know a few little sort of trip around the camera here you've got for the internal metering in the viewfinder you've got this little on off switch here which triggers the metering which is run off the battery underneath uh, you've got two little flash connections there I think X and I'm not quite sure the other one is but you've got two flash connections there you've got a little um, counter a little self timer here on the right hand side with a little button you press through above like so on top see the three main sort of dials you've got the film cassette take up and release catch here and then below it you've got a little dial which is kind of nice but I suppose if you're using film a lot you may need to remember what you've put in whether you've put colour in whether you've put black and white in or whether the camera is currently empty so you, you can rotate that on the right hand side obviously you've got the speed dial so you've got a thousand you've got bulb and obviously faster speeds then you've got a little internal if you lift it a little internal dial inside which sets your ISO or ASA number so you can match your film um, you've got your shutter release you've got your wind on above it you've got your counter what's quite a nice feature with this camera they don't all do this is when you know you've taken some shots so you know, taking your 36 or 24 shots when you've unloaded the, the film, and the way you do that is obviously you release the, the sort of stress on the wine on in, on the inside by pressing this button on the right, and then you'd wind back your film. And when you finish doing that, you obviously open the back of the camera, and in doing that, in pulling this up, it resets the counter back to zero. So your next film, when you put it in, it's already preset at zero, which is really good. And on the inside, obviously, you've got your, you can just see you've got your wind on. The camera's firing quite nicely. Excuse me. Camera's firing, which is great. The viewfinder. Um, it's a great lens. Um, and actually, out of all the cameras I've used so far, I've gone for about six or seven film cameras um, this is the one I've liked the best so far I think it's really really well made it's very simple to use it's very solid it's very sort of logical um, I like it so that's the Pentax Spotmatic